welcome to this session so in this session we will learn oxy acids of phosphorus so this oxy acids of phosphorus is one of the important uh, topic in p block element or you can say group 16 because this topic is uh, usually asked in the examination in different forms how to learn these different type of acids what are the ways because uh, they have they are different type of acids so i have uh, designed this oxy acids of phosphorus in such a way that it will be uh, comfortable and comprehensive in learning so let us uh, initiate this topic and uh, see the techniques so first you take the phosphorus p4 is the phosphorus molecule and if you give air or you can say combustion what will happen if you give a limited supply of oxygen so there are two type of compounds that form one is p2o3 and second is p4o6 and second if you are giving excess oxygen so it will form p4o10 so out of this uh, limited supply of oxygen these two compounds if you give water three molecules of water it will form uh, two molecules of s3po3 while uh, p4o6 if you add six molecules of water so it will give you s3po4 so this uh, acid is called as orthophosphorus acid and uh, uh, second name is called phosphonic acid orthophosphorus or phosphonic as you can see the charge also and again if you heat it it will convert into uh, orthophosphoric acids like this or if you release two molecules of water in this molecule so you can see after laying two molecules of water so 4 into 3 12 12 minus 4 so it will give you pyrophosphorus acid which formula is H4P2O5 so just you multiply four molecules and subtract two molecules of water you will get this formula so this is the limited supply of oxygen and different type of form first is uh, orthophosphorus and from this we are getting two type of acid one is orthophosphoric acid and second is pyrophosphorus acid now other side P4O10, if you add two molecules of water, so we will get here metaphosphoric acid. Oxygen state is plus 5. Again, this uh, metaphosphoric acid, acid is two types. One is if you are taking in SpO3 whole thrice or SpO3 N. So, if this uh, thrice molecule of metaphosphoric acid will form a tricyclic polymeric form. So, this form is your tricyclic. While this SpO3 whole N is taking the linear polymeric form. So I hope you have seen the structures. So this is a linear structure, but this will be a cyclic structures from metaphosphoric acid, first product. Again, if you add water, so what will happen? This will convert into pyrophosphoric acid. This is the pyro, which have seven oxygen, and in this case, which have five oxygen. This is the hypo, sorry, the pyrophosphorus acid from S3PO3, and this is from metaphosphoric acid that's why it is called as the pyrophosphoric acid after adding water it will convert into orthophosphoric acid so like this one uh, from s3po3 we if you are releasing phosphine gas we are getting orthophosphoric acid so you can see this both process now we have one more compound that is called phosphonic acid phosphonic acid that is called uh, hypophosphoric acid or phosphonic acid how does this form so again you take phosphorus and uh, react with the alkaline solution means alkali you will get this compound NaH2PO2 and this gas is released so again this is acidic medium this is treated and it will come become converted into H3PO2 so you can see it is very very different from the orthophosphorus acid which is also called as a phosphonic acid and this is the phosphenic acid phenic means one oxygen less and phonic acid is S3PO3. So this is the basic difference between phosphonic and phosphonic. If you heat this compound, it will convert into again uh, phosphonic acid and uh, this, this uh, phosphine gas is released. So you can see the cycle. Uh, phosphonic acid converting into phosphonic acid, one ammonia, one phosphine gas is released. Again, uh, phos uh, phos Phonic acid is converted into phosphoric acid. So again, PS3 gas release. Again, oxygen state is also increasing plus 1, plus 3, and plus 4. And uh, one more acid we have that is called H4P2O6. This is called as hypophosphoric acid. So when you take uh, this is a 
phonic acid and phosphenic acid. So this is the phosphenic and this is the sorry, this is the phosphonic acid and this is the phosphenic acid. So this is not so this will be your let me write here. This is your called as the phosphonic acid and this is nothing but the orthophosphoric acid. Previously I was telling uh, by mistake wrong. This is the orthophosphoric acid because four oxygen, three oxygen is phonic acid and two oxygen is phenic acid. You have to remember by this is four oxygen, three oxygen, two oxygen. Two oxygen, phenic acid, phenic acid, phonic acid, orthophosphoric acid. So when you add this uh, phonic plus uh, orthophosphoric acid, you will get hypophosphoric acid because plus five is the highest state. And in this case, you will get the uh, oxygen state is plus four. So it becomes hypo. So now we have uh, three acid. One is the phonic acid, uh, sorry, phenic acid, and then phonic acid and orthophosphoric acid. So this is the phenic, phonic, and orthophosphoric. Uh, in this case, uh, this will be your H4P2O5. So H4P2O5 is nothing but uh, pyrophosphorus acid. And this is H4P2O6 is hypophosphoric acid. And H4P2O7 is pyrophosphoric acid. So just uh, see this uh, video uh, repeatedly once again. You will come to know the how the different type of acids uh, are designed or it is formed from the phosphorus.